woman, stop sharing this over that years. You have killed my brother and you have succeeded. And let me tell you, you must leave this house with your children today, whether you like it or not. How do I take care of these children? <laughs> you must leave this house. You have succeeded in killing my brother. And you are happy, right? Stop crying and leave this house. Stop crying. Stop the noise, my friend. I warned my brother not to marry you, this woman. My brother didn't listen to me. Now you see, you have succeeded in killing him. Over my dead body, will you remain in this house? Never. And you will go away with these children wherever you got them from. You will take them and follow you. Been very mean to us, but he's the only one that we have. We're going to meet him today to give us some money for school fees. We have to go to school. I don't have any money at the moment, he's the only uncle that you have. Don't say anything like that to him, okay? Don't worry, God is going to take care of us. It's okay. It's not okay. Just give me a hug. Mm. It's your brother. Yes, yes. Yes, I will be in the parlor watching. You can go watch TV with him, okay? Come here. We'll go see your uncle later, okay? Is that okay? Yes. Right, I'll see you later. Bye. Uncle, good afternoon, sir. Yeah, good afternoon, yes. What can I do for you people? Please, I've come to discuss with you about our boy, your son. Discuss what? I've come to discuss with you about your son. He's going to school. We need money for school fees, sir. After I've told people to move out of the house, you're coming to discuss with me about what school? Uncle, please, if you don't help us, he won't be able to go to school. What school? What school? The same school that the father tried going that he didn't make it? Is that the same school you want him to go? Uncle, for what? Uncle, please, sir. For what? He's going to no school. You're supposed to pack out and leave that house. I don't care about any school. Uncle, please. I don't care about any school. Ask your mother. Your father tried it and he didn't succeed. And you too, you will not succeed. You are not going to any school. Uncle, you please. understand me? Uncle, please. If you, if you send us away, we will not have money for his school fees. He won't be able to go to school. It's just 5,000 we need. Just 5,000. I have told you, this boy, there is no school for him. Get out from my house. Uncle, I can do all things through Christ who gives me strength. Hey, your mother has started teaching you Christ, Abby. Go and make the class to give his school fees. Uncle, please. Go and make the class to give his school fees. Since that's the part you want to talk, you will see. Oh, find my dead body. Will you go to that school? Please get out of my house, please. Come on, Miss Mesa. Uncle. Uncle, why did you kill daddy? <laughs> that's what the mother has been telling you. Don't worry. What be the father? It's only kill the time. What's it for you, baby? This boy has got caught. Girls of my father, you have never failed me, and I've come before you tonight. My brother's son has dead in the lion's tail. And the lion is ready. 
part. And I have come to teach him a lesson. The same road the father went through and he didn't succeed, you want to go through the same road. And I have called my father so you can teach him a lesson. Oh great and fearless serpent, I've called on you to avenge me. Avenge me. Go to my brother's son and teach him a lesson. Ha 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 ha. Go. 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 Thank you, the gods of my father. Jesus. Mommy, mommy. Yes. yes we need to pray. We need to pray. Something is about to happen. Something is about to happen. Did you have a dream? Yes. What is that?